Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving deep into the world of Android customization with three essential exposed modules. If you're a rooted Android enthusiast looking to tweak your device to your liking, then this video is for you. Let's get started. The first module we're checking out is I'm not a developer. This little gem is a lifesaver for those who frequently tinker with their phones. It essentially hides the development mode, USB debugging, and wireless debugging options. Why is this useful? Well, it adds an extra layer of security to your device. Imagine accidentally leaving USB debugging on and someone gaining unauthorized access to your phone, not good. Now, I want to emphasize, do not select any system apps in this module. This can potentially brick your phone. The correct way to use this is to select the specific apps you want these functions to be hidden for. For instance, if you want to hide development options from a specific game, you'd only select that game. As you can see, it's incredibly simple to use. Once enabled, the selected app will no longer have access to development options. Next up, we have Let Me Downgrade. This module is a game changer for those who love to experiment with different app versions. As the name suggests, it allows you to downgrade an app to an older version, even if you have a newer one installed. This is particularly useful for those who prefer older versions of apps due to performance reasons or missing features in newer updates. However, this module comes with a disclaimer, it's experimental, and there's a risk of boot loops. So, use it at your own risk. Also, it's specifically designed for Android 12 to 14 and requires Lisposed. Other exposed variants won't work. To use this module, simply enable it from the Lisposed app. There's also a quick settings tile for easy toggling. It's that straightforward. The final module we're looking at is Disable Target API Block. This one is for the retro app lovers out there. Android 14 introduced a restriction that prevents the installation of apps targeting API levels below 23. This module bypasses that restriction, allowing you to install older APKS without any hassle. It's important to note that while this module works well in most cases, there might be compatibility issues with some apps, so proceed with caution. To use this module, simply enable it from the exposed app. That's it. You can now install those classic apps without any issues. So there you have it, three essential exposed modules that can significantly enhance your Android experience. Remember, rooting your phone comes with risks, so always proceed with caution. And as always, back up your device before making any major changes. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Android tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.